Oh, what now? Mr. Marlowe sent me. What's happening? Raymond said he has some new information. Come to his house as soon as you can. Thanks for the message. I'm not playing that. Huh? Okay. Hey Raymond, your messenger just came. Said you had something you want to say? Welcome, you won't believe what happened. Tell me. Not so fast. Remember, I have expenses. How much do I owe you? 200 arons. This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the Prophet Labiota. I can't live on roots and berries. Neither can my informers. I guarantee you these are the bare necessities. All right, 200 orans. Down to business. They transferred the prisoner after the attack. Not good. Especially since we won't get anything else out of him. He died last night. How did that happen? Well, he wasn't in great shape, so I guess it's no surprise. But I have a feeling... Mm. Someone helped him along? Exactly. Shani is a good friend of yours, right? Ask her to do an autopsy. Once we know the cause of death... Wait a minute. Are you spying on me? That's my job. See you later. <laughs> well, at least you're honest about it. Okay. So, Shani. Ah, there you are. Hi, we have to do an autopsy. You'll be fine. I... Quickly, I need to get back to work. Yes, you do. I need you to help me with an autopsy. What? That's illegal. It's necessary. Visit me at night. We'll talk. Where are you staying? I have a room in the northeastern end of Vizima. Easy to find? Opposite the house, there's a small square with a sculpture of a snake. Quickly, I need to get back to work. All right. We'll wait then. Zoom. Well, let's leave then and see if we can get to do an autopsy. That'll be interesting. Map show where? There. Did I hear something? Oh, no matter. Can't jump this? Seriously? Well, that's sad. Wow. Thank you, guys. The soldiers around here are actually very competent. That reminds me, I had I actually had to kill the rape down here. Nothing personal, mind you. It's just my job. Wrong way. Raglan, let's do this. Eternal fire, fill my heart. 
Well, that was really nice helping me there. Now die. Tell me, do you ever take those corpses down? I mean, don't they smell a lot? I imagine they would. I'll get to Shandy's house. Bit of a trip. See you later. And we have arrived. What's she want? Say something! I'm here to see Shani. She's busy cleaning and doesn't have time for vagabonds! Good. I have an appointment. Didn't your mother teach you better manners? She'd not forgive herself for raising such a monster! But... Okay, what? No, no! Where are you going? No one teach you manners? I'm here to see Shani. Sits in a room entertaining guests and pays next to nothing in rent! Uh huh. Poor kitten, her mother can't even afford food for her. I don't dare feed her the medic's food. She'll likely fall sick. Uh-huh. Will you take pity on the kitty? Here. That should be enough for cat food. Upstairs, my prince! Yeah, yeah. Shut up before I shove you directly into the fire. You know, maybe you shouldn't go to sleep like that when you know I'm coming. Finally, you found me. Looks like it. How'd you get past the old hag? That nice lady downstairs? She's made my life hell. Old people are like that. At least my rent is low. Doctors earn little in Tamaria. Many leave. You stayed. Someone had to. Anyway. Yes? Shani, I wanted to ask you something. Mm-hmm. I need your help with an autopsy. An autopsy? Since when do you deal with stuff like that? Since I started investigating Salamandra. Okay, though, I'm no coroner. You'll have to interpret our findings. We'll meet in the evening. Until then, gather as many clues as possible. I'll sniff around. Get the body from the grave digger. We'll meet at the hospital in the evening. My phone's ringing. Okay, I'm back. How do I find information to help the autopsy? Ask Vincent Mice, but also look for books on anatomy and pathology. Farewell. Ask Vincent. Read books. Goodness. That should be interesting. Anything else I need to do now? No, I can't think of anything.
Ah, the fireplace. Be careful. Could I possibly brew something? Hmm. My balls itch. Fascinating. You're talking about me, aren't you? Nice. And there she is. Speak softly, or someone will spot us together. I've dealt with your husband. Have you proof? You didn't mention proof. I want my gold. You're depriving a widow of her pittance. Yes. Quiet down. Aren't you afraid of being seen in the company of a witcher? Damn you! Take your gold and be gone! You know, maybe your husband had legitimate reasons to be angry at you. What do you need? A corpse. You seem to know a lot about the deaths in the city. Ever help with investigations? Sometimes I inform Raymond about the more interesting dead men. Maybe you can tell me, too. No. I promise to keep quiet. I see. What do you need? A prisoner died recently. Is he in the cemetery already? Don't know. You can have another body. They all reek the same. I'm after a specific corpse. Particular. Come back when you know what you want. Examining remains is an art. Always worthwhile to look deeper. But... Who does that concern? Could you hand over the prisoner's body for an autopsy? For a bottle of dwarven liquor. <laughs> Nothing like a good drink. Whew. About the prisoner. Where you want the body dumped? At the hospital. It'll be there by evening. Farewell. Thanks. Well, it's lucky I didn't manage to drink all of that. Vincent, let's talk about dead people and what we see in them. What is it, Witcher? You ever do autopsies? What for? Punctured stomachs mean gang warfare, torn off heads mean beasts, and black tongues mean poison. The first case, we pressure ram's meat. The second, we pass on to the Order or a Witcher. The third, we go to the victim's wife. The culprit 90% of the time. Autopsies are a waste of time. Well, that was helpful. 
Autopsies are a waste of time. Huh. Well, not gonna get much help there. It's time to do some reading. They think nothing but money. What do you want? Actually, I think I already read this. Huh. In that case... Let's probably get this. more info, you know. 